So recently we've had some massive and fascinating image leaks coming from Netflix's live action avatar, and today I'm going to break them down, so smash that like and subscribe button, and let's get into it. So a bunch of on-set and behind-the-scenes pictures were leaked of a bunch of kids dressed up as air nomads, likely recreating the scene from early on in the show, where we see them not wanting to associate with Aang because of him being the avatar, and them feeling like he has an unfair advantage in anything that he does. This was a really impactful and emotional scene, which really hit Aang and viewers in the feels. So seeing it in live action is going to be very interesting. In another image, we get a very rough look at live action monkey Yatso, which is very exciting. And although we can't tell exactly what scene it is, there's a lot of speculation from this one image alone. While it could be related to a flashback to Aang's childhood and Gyatso teaching him, it looks to me more like he's somewhere on fire and is very concerned, possibly seeing someone or something that he wished he'd never come across. There were some rumours a while back that there would be a scene which featured the Air Nomads being questioned about the location of the Avatar and eliminated when they refused to comply. Maybe this scene is Gyatso getting ready for a last stand against all the firebenders, leading us to see his skeleton the way it was when Aang found him many years later. Here's what the actress who posted the images said, Avatar The Last Airbender, an American drama produced by Netflix, has finally officially been announced and we are honoured to have three students from our Vancouver Repertory Theatre to participate in the production. Let me first make public some onstage photos we participated in at the time, mischievous. This time I played the role of a monk. This half-bold look took me five hours to do, but it was easy for the boys. They were finished with just a cha. By the way, this is my first time filming abroad, and I'm really lucky to be able to participate in Netflix's masterpiece, The Avatar. North American crews are extremely humane compared to the domestic crews, especially for child actors. They strictly abide by the eight-hour working hours and have to pay two or three times extra if they exceed that time limit. Since the filming was during an epidemic, nucleic acid tests were required every few hours, and it's really great that we got $100 for each test, and each child who shaved their head was given $500. After this week's filming, each of our students earned at least several thousand dollars. Sounds pretty good to me. So as we can see, this was a very fun shoot, which the crew really enjoyed, very wholesome, and it's only fitting that such great memories are made on such a wonderful show. Now, let's just hope the final product is actually good, and let's hope that it doesn't end up like the movie that we will never, ever speak about. What do you guys think of these reveals? Let me know in the comments down below. Smash that like and subscribe button if you enjoyed. And this is the place if you want to see more Avatar lore content. I'll see you in the next one.